How hard should you train? How hard should you train? How hard should you really train? Um, if you're a fighter, right? Anybody that comes to me that's a fighter, they've got to put the time in because they're fighting or a competition, swimming, tennis, boxing, Thai boxing, whatever. You need that stamina and you need that stamina to win that competition for you there, right? But 80% of my clients, it's all really general fitness. You don't need to knock your pan in in the gym. I can tell you this right now, right? Now, at the start, everybody's going to feel a wee bit sore. And some new clients that saw my Facebook, they know, they'll put that down the bottom and say, I, I was sore. But that's just natural because you've not been doing anything. So, you're, 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 when you come to the gym for just a general fitness, you want to enjoy your training. You're right? You don't want to be going, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. You don't want to do that, right? You want to be making it work for you, so totally enjoying it, and just just seeing exactly where your weight is. And, and as I say, nice seat, like I said in the video before, and your carbs and things like that for there. Just general fitness is ideal. You don't need to be regimented in here unless you are in competition mode. Simple as that.